hi Pisces thank you for being here with me um, this is a reading for Pisces mid-August 2019 it's a general reading so it won't resonate with every Pisces but if it does resonate with you like share comment subscribe to the channel it is much appreciated thank you to those who have done so all right so let's get into it all right Pisces I pulled three cards you can get this same spread it is six dollars sixty six cents it is the situation the advice and the outcome and then the overall energy at the bottom of the deck okay we'll look at it together is the high priestess in reverse now none of these cards should be in reverse because I don't um yeah none of these cards should be in reverse but this one's reversed so it looks like um, Pisces you need to use your intuition a little bit better uh, you need to be able to pick up on signals you you are kind of at this point a little lost in regards to uh, the body language the unspoken signals of um, you need to tap in and tune in just a little bit more um, there might be need to be some some planning some pre-planning done some rearrangement of um, you may not be as focused as you 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 want to be that's like uh, something where you are not centered you're off a bit off kilter is what I'm hearing like you eh, something something has you off you you also maybe for some of you is coming out of the shadows coming out of the wind you may have been in the you may have played the background the, the you know you may have been just in in the, in the shadows and now you want to come out of that some of you there is some feminine advice that you should be taking to but you are not once again not using your intuition and not picking up on the subtle the subtlety of um, body language and and or um you know uh, you know the nonverbal okay uh yeah a lot going on here in regards to the high priestess in reverse so the high priestess upright she's very spiritual she's been on this journey i think the for some of you Pisces, you need to look within. Look within. You need... There's like an air of delusion here. Yeah. Self-delusion. You... Okay. I'm not even going to say that. Um, let's move on. Somebody... I don't know if somebody's saying it to you, about you, Pisces, but somebody says you are not hot shit you think you're hot shit but you're not hot shit and i don't even curse really on this channel uh but and forgive me if that offends you but somebody is telling you no you're not and you may even feel that way um everything is about course correction and being able to take constructive criticism some of you are not taken to some really good feminine advice it, it may be even towards your femininity all right situation the nine of cups nice uh nine of cups says of course wish fulfillment make a wish it could very well come true you are not at the highest level of happiness but you're definitely at a place where you have cultivated um, an air of, uh, of happiness, uh, of travel, of learning, uh, of ethics, 
you've really gotten to a place in, in regards to that. And Pisces, this 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 high priestess in reverse could be someone else too. Doesn't have to be. So everything that I talked about could be someone else. Okay. Um. The Nine of Cups talks about separation too. So you feel like you are separated from what will make you very, very happy. The highest level of happiness could be family. Having your own family could be uh, having a man, having some masculine energy, a protecting energy, providers, um, happiness here. Uh, the advice is the Ace of Wands. So this is about let people experience you by way of your energy and your doing. Once again, it may be like a pre plan you need a you need a revamp. There like needs to be a an overhaul, maybe for some of you, an overhaul of you. You've got comfortable and content with you fill in the blank in regards to yourself Pisces so it says the ace of wands you need to be more motivated passionate toward what it is you this nine of cups but you're hoping and wishing for what you're trying to manifest some of you it could be business it could be love and romance we'll pull uh, three clarifying cards and then we'll, we'll really get into it at the extended read uh, the outcome, if you take the advice of the cards, um, wow, the star, being on the right path, knowing that you're on the right path, being on the right path. See, the high priestess is, priestess is on that spiritual journey. She's enlightened. She's planning. She's, she knows what's coming next. She knows what she needs to do or he knows what he needs to do um, she's all knowing in in regards to herself or himself um, the outcome for you could be the star meaning that you could engage in a level of notoriety fame um, just altogether attention so for some of you, it's, this is like an overhaul. You need to have an overhaul of self. You've got content and comfortable in whatever it is you were doing or not doing. Um, you need to have an overall overhaul. Yeah, overall, you need to have an overhaul. Right? Um, there needs to be... Uh, see, this is the coming out of the spiritual journey. You need to come out of the planning, Pisces, and start doing. You need to get motivated to do. Uh, you or or come out of that. Um, oh, this is like stagnation and stubbornness, not wanting to change. You, you're definitely committed to one position. But these cards say that maybe you need to... There needs to be a revamp in uh, a new vitality, energy. Um, health, wealth, and happiness needs to be... Needs to come from within. It needs to be exuded from you. You can't be expecting it from the outside or for someone to, to provide that to you. When nothing about you says health, wealth, and happiness. I'm sorry guys I don't know where that comes from but let's see what is really going on what's the advice for my Pisces what's the advice for my Pisces some of you could be dealing with uh, an Aquarius person Cancer Pisces Scorpio some of you want you want a family but you can't afford a family you you're not doing anything to cultivate and be able to maintain and provide for family but it's a whole big old wanting yeah. romance and that may be where you are you know you. 
so romance is not just okay I'm uh, I, I want to get it on with somebody I want it to be hot and heavy this could be a Pisces person romanticizing uh, a situation a bit too much to where they're not looking at it logically and rationally once again you have to come out of that 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 sense come out of not having a clear and surefire plan for yourself um, have, being stagnant stuck stubborn in one position committed to doing the very least or, or nothing at all or not changing um, that's what you're committed to um, you may be romanticizing an idea also with the ace of wands romanticizing uh, the idea of you and someone else when you're doing nothing to c cultivate this 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 idea um, some of you could just be having romance okay come out the I'm here come out of the clouds like really start doing and changing in the near future you have a timeline in the near future you need to do this you need to or you may see if you take the advice of the cards to get more motivated in regards to health wealth and happiness what it is you want for yourself it could come to you in the near future okay one more card for the Pisces unlikely but yeah if you believe at the bottom of the day this is what I'm saying like something is unlikely to come to fruition for you and for you to stand directly in what it is you want if you are unmovable if you're un, un you know you're uncompromising you're you're um ooh, unbearable uh delusional uh some of you are trying to come out of that self delusion take talk to a girlfriend or maybe I'm a guy friend I don't know talk to somebody it says feminine energy here somebody's gonna give you some really good advice in regards to um, but you have to be receptive to it and and um, always keep in mind that other people's opinions uh, are valid they don't mean they're true they don't mean they're accurate they mean you have to take it but they're valid you know there's some validity, validity in everything. Uh, so there we are. You know, um, Pisces. Meet me on the other side to see. I really feel like this is a Pisces who needs to. It's kind of like surface based a bit first, and then they want you to dive deep. So you need to revamp your life. Some of you are are, are asking more than you you're willing to give. Or this is vice versa. Someone is doing this to you, Pisces. Asking so much of you, you and giving so little. Um, for some of you, if it's something that you want, that you feel like you are without, or someone you want and you feel like you are without, this is about the action and the the coming into having a surefire plan to get what it is you want. It says that some of you you yeah you could be coming into a place of, of commitment some of you are just committed to doing the absolute least come out of that because it's, it's unlikely that you'll get what you want all right so we're going over to the website Pisces thank you for being here things will turn out well because you have really good cards it's just more so about now um getting what you want it's like it's you're right on the cusp of that it's like some of you are moving forward like you can have romance in the near future but it's unlikely if you make no changes if you have no clear plan of how to have that with a particular person place or thing whatever uh so yeah 
goodness is here for you this is nice all right so meet me on the other side pisces thank you the link is below uh to bring in that love and that romance um you know i suggest that you get um you definitely get your red candle if it's from me or someone else get a red candle burn it um in the morning at night uh say a small prayer in regards to what it is or who it is you want to come into your life or just state your affirmations for yourself in regards to love the red candle is about passion passionate love the romance um so yeah and that's than that uh there's also a coupon i'll put that below if you want to take advantage of purchasing those candles at the website uh pisces it looks good but it's about you having a surefire plan uh, and being committed to doing a little bit more just a tad bit more okay all right see you on the other side pisces thank you stay in prayer guys bye